Hi guys, it's Aziz from Technique and today I just wanted to show you a launcher that I recently discovered called Launcher Lab. Pretty new launcher as far as I know. It's done pretty well for the short time it's been on the Play Store for. It's got 100,000 downloads for 4.2 and it's got 4.2 rating. The whole aspect of it, the whole idea behind it is to make a launcher by yourself basically. They provide you the tools so it says 100% customize your android phone with diy themes to define your personal style so that's basically the approach on it it's a pretty awesome app launcher um that's why i thought i'd do a video showing you guys there's quite a lot you can do with it do keep in mind that they do have a youtube channel showing you how to use the launcher a bit more depth than maybe my video i just wanted to shed some light for you guys that haven't um heard of this awesome launcher it's made by X app team and it's got some quite good reviews so once you download it and install it the first thing that would happen would they would give you like um, like other applications they'll just give you a few startup starter tips basically and how it works is like a normal launcher you can go into your app drawer etc at the moment there are a few features that I would like probably because I'm coming from Nova launcher but like I said, it's pretty new launcher, so hopefully as they go along, they'll add more features. One of the things I do miss from other launcher is the fact that when you swipe up, normally I could open another application, but with this launcher, it goes to your control center, I guess, and you can access these. Although these are useful, but I can access them from my quick settings anyway. So I would like the option to at least change that and um, maybe open application. But yeah, um, they're definitely in the right track. Um, I do like it a lot. So from there, you can go into your system settings and you can go into your launcher settings. So from here, the launcher settings, you can make it your default launcher standard stuff. Um, screen settings, so you've got design screens, which I'll go into a bit later in the video. You can select your wallpaper and your grid size. You can obviously update the application from here or take it to the Play Store. Back up and restore it. So you're flashing a ROM, etc. Or you're going to another launcher, you can back up and restore your settings. You have guide here. So it's a basic introduction of how the launcher works, etc. That video. And here's just the standard stuff. So once once you download and install it, what I've done is I've added my own page. And I've also kept some of the ones that they've given me. And I've basically tweaked it so how it works is you hit an empty space and you can just basically customize it you can change the wallpaper obviously i'll get into themes so basically once you've made your themes you can upload it um your own one and you could also download other people's themes so for example if you like a theme you could just you know download it I've downloaded one earlier on so just say you like this one Let's say you like this one you could just download it straight away Obviously, depending on your internet connection, it will differ. So yeah, they have got a theme store where you can download other people's one and you could also upload your own one. So if you like my one or if you like a certain aspect of it, maybe I can upload it later on. I haven't really spent too much time. I've been using it for roughly about three weeks, sorry, two weeks. Yeah, so what, what you do, so you go to adding and then basically you can add your apps, folders and your widgets. So standard stuff going on here. You also have the option to your screen view. So from here you could check all your screens. And here you have the ones that you've downloaded, the screens. You've also got your designs, the ones that you've basically customized yourself. And here are some of their ones that they've given, like some default screens which I've added here. And here you have here you can add a new one. So once you go into new you can basically hold on to it, edit it. Yeah, so you hold on to it and you press delete. Okay, so that's how you do it. Now, what you do is you can add a custom image. You go here and then from the left you swipe. And then all these are all the things you can basically add. So you've got music settings, you can add some weather information, you can also add date analog clock shapes and you could also add the image or text but for the purpose of this video just to keep it short i'll add a text so what you do is you got your text here you go into position you can position it 
obviously you can position this and also this so just put it here for now and then once you've got that sorted uh, zoom rotate etc you can do all that here decoration so you can choose what you want it to be so for example for the purpose of the video i'll write fancy one of the applications i use you could choose your font here let's just go for uppercase and also your font here um, and then you can actually choose the attribute of it so you can choose your action so just say this application here fancy it's a pretty cool application and you got your transition here so there's quite a bit you can change about it let's just make it a bit big so there that's it so now it does work so if I go back and I exit this mode you can save it as a new screen I enter that and it will take me straight into the application so that's just a, a brief idea of how it works I would like um, a few other things like being able to change the icon for example if I want to change the icon or something edit it will just give me the other basically it doesn't support icon packs which I'd like um, quite a bit or maybe I'm missing something they also do have a YouTube channel if you want to check that out basically i'll leave the link in the description on how to use this launcher a bit more thoroughly um but this was just to give you a rough idea on how to use this launcher i find it pretty cool obviously i've set these up myself the wallpaper was actually from them thanks for watching guys that's launcher lab i hope you enjoyed this video like comment subscribe and i'll see you in the next one